welcome to a new vlog. I decided I'm just gonna pick up the camera today. Um, I don't really have much going on. Um, just gonna drop later off at school in a little bit. I am gonna clean. We're gonna make some bars. So my friend Alex posed that I really wanted to make myself. They're like made with like cake mix and we're gonna attempt those today. Like a little dessert that'll work out. Um, clean, I already said that. I didn't order it, I need to keep my life in check, okay? But I decided I have not picked up the camera since like, I think our camping trip, oh no, our trip back to Rhode Island. It's been a minute. So we decided we're gonna pick up the camera today. We're gonna, we're gonna chat and um, hang out. Um, I don't really have much plan, like I said. Yesterday I did take the kids to story time. So we went to story time yesterday. Um, and we actually went with our neighbor. Um, she has a two year old and like our kids are like besties now. Super cute. I finally have a friend here guys. I finally have a friend. Um, at least I think she's a friend. <laughs> um, but yeah, we did that yesterday. So freaking cute. You guys like it was adorable. We did spooky songs and stories and then they went trick treating like around the library and got candy. Kids had fun. I don't really do much yesterday. I just did that, picked up some groceries, and that's pretty much it. Um, I do. I was gonna actually film a grocery haul yesterday, but uh, I decided not to. I'm just like not really in the mood for like filming lately. I have not been feeling like filming. I've been a lot more active on Instagram, posting reels on TikTok and stuff like that. But that's pretty much it. YouTube's just been a little. I don't know, I feel like a lot of people go through the phases on YouTube, but I know a lot of you guys also miss my videos. I know a lot of you guys, not to be like, you guys miss me, but I've been getting a lot of like comments and, um, not comments, messages, sorry, about you guys asking like, oh, like, are you going to post YouTube again or whatever, post on YouTube again, and I'm like, oh, I don't know, but I do want to, I kind of do want to still post like here and there, but it's just... YouTube can be very discouraging. I say this all the time, but you know, growing on YouTube is just not what it used to be. And I feel like people don't really watch videos as much anymore like they used to. I do want to post on here. It's just kind of hard. I mean, my kids are very crazy right now. They are very loud, rambunctious little toddlers. I just sent them off to their playroom. I was like, go in the playroom for a little bit before we go like have lunch and bring Landon to school. <laughs> and so they're up there now, but my house is literally a madhouse 24 7 and now that it's getting chilly out they can't play outside as much and i feel like that's kind of like contributing 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 to them being even more rambunctious you know um but yeah we want to post on here so i was like you know what i'm not really doing much today but i know these vlogs were the kinds that you guys thoroughly enjoyed before so hopefully you enjoyed this one um we're just we're really like we're just doing some around the house stuff so around the house what's happening type things um and just some cleaning just some cleaning some baking um i'll even probably show you guys tonight how i do my air fryer salmon since we've been eating a shit ton of salmon um it's like we're like obsessed um even like landon is always like can we have salmon for dinner can we have salmon um so we're gonna do that tonight too I was actually supposed to make salmon yesterday, but my salmon ended up being frozen, which I took it out of the freezer and it was thawing, but it didn't thaw out in time. And I was like, that's so bizarre, but whatever. Um, we're going to make salmon tonight. I'll show you guys how I do it. Um, we're probably going to end up making salmon bowls because I actually don't have a lot of salmon um, left because the salmon, the salmon that I had is actually like was cut up from like a whole piece and then we had that and then this was like the leftover part so i froze it um so i'll probably do make salmon bowls because again i don't have that much salmon um but i'll show you guys how i air fry it what i do to it and then i'll show you guys dinner too if you guys want we are back on a diet must say um not that i'm like i need to lose weight um uh, i do want to lose five pounds though um since we came home from rhode island i feel like just kind of like bloated and just not feeling great so i do want to like lose some like five pounds so i am calorie counting right now um i am working out still with cameron and doing weights and everything but i am trying to add just some more cardio into my um, routine because obviously cardio helps you lose weight um so 
just doing a little bit of that. Um, I've been trying to eat, not that I'm trying to eat healthier, we're gonna be making cake bars today, but trying to eat healthier and, you know, working on our, uh, what's the word called? Our diet. Our, we're trying to eat a little better. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do that. Show you what's going on. Um, I'm like, I'm trying to like, what should I tell you guys? Um, we're getting ready right now. I dyed my hair red. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you would already know. Um, but I dyed my own hair red. <laughs> but it's like a red violet. It's like a, I did more purple in my hair. I did do it myself. Um, I love it. I'm like here for it. Um, but I know like everyone's going red right now. But so be it. If you want to go red, go red. I had so much fun doing it. I did at home. I got, um, I went to Sally's. I didn't do a box dye. I went to Sally's and I got um, a 5VR and a 6RR. And I did two ounces of the 5VR, one ounce of the 6RR, and I did the, um, three ounces of like the developer and stuff. And then I did that throughout my whole head. And I love it. But I had all virgin hair too. So like my hair took really well to the, all the color. Um, I talked to my cousin who is a hair, uh, she went to hair, uh, cosmetology school so I like asked her like and I kind of like was like I want to do this and like she kind of like told me like what to do so don't freak out you guys like I had a professional help me out via FaceTime uh, but I did do it at home and I love it I'll have to show you guys it looks a lot different in like the sun than it does indoors indoors it's definitely more like violet when the sun hits it it's more red but we're gonna get ready quick and then we're gonna get started. It's not even, it's like 10 o'clock already. Like it's almost 10.30, like the day's already started. I've been up since early. <laughs> um, I can't remember what time I woke up, but um, the day's been started, but we're just getting ready now. I was playing board games with Asher. So we're gonna get ready um, and I will catch you guys in a little bit. 11.06 right now. We're about to make, oh, 11.09 actually. And we're gonna make the kids some lunch. Um, Boys, come over here so you can eat lunch. I think I'm gonna make them a ham and cheese sandwich. I just bought ham yesterday. Oh, but here comes my dogs. Um, my kids are obsessed with ham and cheeses, um, but they're like weirdos and they like it plain. But we're gonna be using this bread. What? We open the yogurt. <laughs> well, that's good helping. I want a Okay, can, wait, hold on. Can you go grab some spoons? Okay. I want to. What color do you want? Let's go. No, I'm going to get You want outlet and get and, and thing? Okay, go get some spoons. Oh, well, let's quit. No, you guys are going to have what you want. Um, I am using the Sour Lee Delight 45 calorie um, bread. This is actually really good. I mean, two slices is 90 calories. If you're counting calories, it's really good bread. But it's also like a really good um, bread. The boys really like it too. Um, they're just gonna have a ham and cheese sandwich and they're gonna have a little, they like, like these yogurts. Um, I want that. Okay, no. Nope. Uh, we're gonna make my, a sandwich. My tomorrow. <laughs> Mommy, I love it. Mommy, I love it. Mommy, I love it. You love it? Yeah. We have a ham and cheese and some yogurt. Hi, vlog. Hi, vlog. Okay, you guys can start on your yogurt while I make your sandwich. Um. It tastes weird because I You just brush your teeth. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we're just gonna do some ham and cheese. They're eating their yogurt. I have to try it. It tastes weird. How's your yogurt? Good. I have to try it. It tastes weird. Yeah. <laughs> It's so weird. If you guys remember, like when I first had Asher, like I feel like he's so big now. He's gonna be three in December. It's so sad. And I'm gonna be five. You're gonna be five, I know. I don't want to talk about it. And I'm gonna have a glow box one day. Yeah, so he says. Asher wants a Spider Man birthday party, and Landon wants a Roblox birthday party. Bless you. Ooh. Ooh. Uh -oh. Let me get you a tissue. Okay. Finished making sandwiches. So yeah, we're just doing some ham and cheeses. My kids are pretty basic. They like just ham and cheese. No 
condiments. Sometimes you guys like mustard though. Do you want mustard on it or no? Uh, this is the, the mustard, the mustard, a little bit mustard right here. And and put the mustard on the side. No, I'm not giving you ketchup. Ketchup does not go on ham and cheeses. That's yucky. But, but I don't like tasting the mustard. So then don't eat mustard. But I kind of do want it. Hmm. Struggles with being a toddler. We got some veggie straws. My dear, what is my dear? What is our favorite one? Yes. Um, I it sucks because I have to give like Landon lunch at like eleven o'clock because he goes to school at twelve and they have snack time, but like you know he has to have lunch too. Here. So nice, quick, easy lunch. Um, I'm going to. I just finished cleaning out the rest of the toys in the living room. I'm going to quickly vacuum while they're eating, um, so that way, because when I come home, usually Asher falls asleep and I don't want to vacuum while he's sleeping. Hey. What? He didn't get any mustard. Oh, I thought you didn't want the mustard. Well, I kind of do. Oh, okay. Mustard. You want me to get you some mustard? I'll get you some mustard. Um, so yeah, I'm going to quickly vacuum mm. before we leave, because we have to leave here by like, I'd say like 11.45 the latest. Let me well, test that. I'll do the arm one. Okay. No, cat, it's mustard. No, no, no. no, mustard? Ketchup doesn't go with the sandwich. Want mustard? Got on the side? Yeah. Yeah! Yeah, mm -hmm. well, it did like that. So, yeah, I'm gonna cook this, put the light, and then we're gonna vacuum. But I'm so frustrated. Hello to my lonely name. I like to be educated, but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess the ignorance is bad. Just drop Landon off at school. I just had like, some lunch and everything, um, letting my camera charge. But so I've been trying to make star sourdough a starter because my I love sourdough bread. I love sourdough bread. I've been wanting to make it at home for so long. I debated on even buying the sourdough starter. Like I like I know like Whole Foods has it, and like I think I've seen it at Trader Joe's too. Um, but like I just don't have patience to like do it at home. But my neighbor has brought me a couple times sourdough bread that she's made from her own starter. And I'm like, I'm determined. I'm determined to make it. And it has mold on it. This is like day three. And it has like three pieces of mold on it. So I have to toss it. This is like day three. So like you're supposed to like, to make your starter, you need to go like a full seven days of like, feeding it and blah, 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 whatever and mine went fucking bad and i'm so pissed off because like i just i just want to make some starter like i just want to make some sourdough and now i gotta toss all this out in the trash oh yeah it's, it smells like butthole i don't know what happened you can see the like right there you can see like the I'm gonna have to toss this and then we're gonna start over. I'm gonna wash my dish really, really well and then we're gonna start over. I'm so sad because there's like a few recipes that I wanted to make that's like for the fall. Well, I mean, November is still good, but I think what could have happened is the towel hit the, um, the bowl, uh, like the, the dough. And I'm thinking when that happened, it probably like fucked with it somehow. So we're just gonna start it again. We're gonna wash the dish and then start over. So yeah. again, I have my clean bowl, clean bowl. One cup of water. And I'm just gonna mix it up. 
and I swear. So my neighbor, I was like, uh, what the heck did I do wrong? And she was like, try stirring it a couple times a day. So I'm going to do that. Um, because I don't know, like, I, I don't know what I did wrong. I was like really disappointed because like I tried really hard. I was like, I'm going to be a homemaker, whether I like it or not. I will be one. We are going to be one. So now I have to start over. It's on day three. And now I have to start yet again. I did it in a glass bowl like I didn't put it in like <clears throat> I know it I read something was like don't use metal plastic because it can like mess with like the, um, the I don't know it messes with something use like glass and I'm like perfect like okay glass I'm trying what's wrong what's not working I'm gonna cover her up with a flower for um this one's a uh, you could do like a, I don't know, this is like a flower cloth thing. I don't know what they're called. A tea cloth. What are they called? I don't know, but it's like the ones that you use for like breads and stuff. We're going to cover this up. And we'll check on it in 24 hours. And hopefully, I mean, nothing happened the first time. It was like once I did it for the third day. Like today's the third day and then I started seeing the mold. So I don't know, but I'll give it a couple of zhuzh but um since ash are still napping i'm actually going to show you guys how to make that um little thing so, i don't even know what they call it it's like a cake <sighs> like a, a cake bar i guess i don't know um my friend posted it and she's like if you know you know and i'm like mm, don't know enlighten me what are you making um so I got some stuff. They substituted my cake mix. Um, I asked for yellow cake mix and they gave me the great value one, but whatever. I guess cake mix, yellow cake mix, um, sweet condensed milk. I think you need, I need some kind of chocolate, but I'm gonna have to dig into the kids' candy because they didn't have the Halloween candy that I wanted, the Halloween M&Ms. Um, my friend used Reese's, which I thought was genius. I think I may chop up some Reese's too. Um, I'm not sure yet. I kind of want to do like a monster mash type thing. So I think I'm going to mix up like different candies and I was going to put spooky eyeballs in it. But let me pop up her thing because she like sent it to me. And I was like, mm. I kind of saved it though. So hold on. I saved like the screenshot she sent me from her friend. But they're supposed to look like, so this was my friend's. It looks like this. And then like you pop it in the fridge and you let it like cool and stuff. Um, so you need box cake. She says that, I guess the girl said, I don't know who it is that does it because it doesn't even say it on there, but you could use yellow or white, um, or you could do chocolate and use Oreos instead of Reese's. Ooh, that would sound really, really good. I should have done that. I should have read this. You could have done, I could have done chocolate cake with Oreos and eyeballs. That would have been so good. Um, sweetness milk, one egg, and then a fourth cup of oil plus a little extra, and then candy. Perfect. So let's preheat our oven. 350. Okay. Let's see. Let's get a bowl. The lighting's trash, but it's better. Um, so we're going to take a bowl and yellow cake mix. That'd be good. She said it was really good. If she said, my friend Alex said her husband, who doesn't even like sweets, I can't do this. This is too dark. I'll flip you guys to this side. This is like the side that just has like better lighting over here. Um, her friend Alex, though, she said her husband doesn't even like sweets and he ate like he devoured two of them. So, pretty hopeful. I'm actually thinking if these are done in time, it's one o'clock now. Probably not. Maybe I'll bring them tomorrow. Um, I was going to bring some to the girls at the gym. Because um, they, like, love my boys. It's so funny. We were talking, and I was like, they're like, oh, yeah, we are talking about High School Musical. I talked about this on my Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, you should follow me. Um, but 
they're like, oh yeah, I love High School Musical. I was like, oh no, High School Musical is like my childhood. Like that was me like in like middle school and stuff. And then we were talking and she's like, oh yeah, I want to be Gabrielle. I was like, wait, how old are you? And she's like, 19. And I was like, oh, you're 19. Oh my God, you're a baby. Um, but they're super, super sweet girls. Like there's two of them that, we go to the gym like six days a week. So there's two girls there that are like the main girls that we always see at night. And my boys like love them. So Landon and Asher usually bring them candy. And then I think we're gonna make some treats. Um, let's get some foil. Got this like big ass container of vegetable oil. Um, a while ago because I feel like I run out of vegetable oil so quickly. I know not everyone likes it. Some people use coconut oil and all that, but vegetable oil is just convenient and it's just cheaper and it's dessert. Like, who really cares? <gasps> okay, a fourth cup of oil. Oh, fuck. I just spilled some of it. I'm just like completely mixed. I just cleaned my cabinets too, like the other day. All right, whatever. Fourth cup of oil. And I think it said one egg, right? Let's see. Oh, box cake mix. One egg. Okay. Mix egg, cake mix, and oil together. How much oil was it? A fourth cup. Okay, one egg. Let's get an egg. with me what the hell I'm absolutely gonna like use this egg though all right got a different egg in there I don't know what my problem is today but we are not doing well we're not today's not our day I'm gonna whisk this together I think we need more oil so you still want it you want the consistency that it's still crumbly where you can pat it down so on the directions thing, it says that you can't add another like splash of oil. Let's not spill it, because I spilled the egg and the oil. I don't know, I like woke up today and just, I feel like, you know when you wake up and everything's like kind of going wrong? Today's kind of been one of those days. And maybe today should have not have been a good day to like film, but. You see here first, folks, I am not great. That's why, like, every, some people are like, oh, like, you do so much, like, you cook, you clean, like, you're, I make dinner every single night. You know, I try really hard to, like, make homemade things as much as I can. I mean, homemade. But, like, I try really hard to, like, make things and cook and all that stuff. And everyone's like, oh, I don't know how you do it. And I'm like, honestly, I don't. I just try. You know, I'm not... I grew up with my mom really always cooking. My mom was always in the kitchen. My mom was always cooking and cleaning and you know, I really thrive on that. I think actually, thanks mom if you're watching this, I think because of my mom, she has such OCD that I have OCD and like I, I can't be in a house that my house is like destroyed. Like it drives me nuts. It overstimulates me so bad. That's my own problem now. Thanks my mom. And I know I'm kind of pushing on my kids because like when it's us, I'm like, all right, now, now it's time to clean up you guys. And sometimes I don't want to, and I'm like, that's fine. And usually when that happens, like I will just clean up for them. Like I cleaned up their playroom the other night and Lana walked in the other next day. He goes, oh, my playroom's clean. I was like, yeah, mommy cleaned it. But like my Asher especially, like Asher makes a mess so bad. But Asher also will really clean up after himself. He doesn't like to see a mess a lot either. Sometimes, depending on what it is. But like, not that I really want to do it to my kids, but it's happening. But, you know, I try to cook. I try to make things. And I, I want my kids to, like, know mom tried. You know, are we perfectionists? No. Sometimes I make things and I'm like, this is disgusting. Like, <laughs> you know, but I tried. You know, like, at least I made the effort of trying to make food at home or, like, trying something new. And that's what matters. But, yeah, this is what it looks like. This is pretty crumbly. Um... And now let's see what it says. 
So it says spray a 9 by 13 pan and pat down like 70% of the mix into the pan. Then pour a layer of mini Reese's all over and cover with the entire can of condensed milk. Then pat down the remaining cake mix on top. Let's see, bake 350 for like 25 minutes. It has to set up before you cut into it or it'll be so gooey and messy. I usually pop it in the fridge overnight or you can just let it sit for an hour or two to cool. Okay. So let's get a pan. I think I'm not gonna do a nine by 30 pan. I'm gonna do like a small one. I think that's like a nine by nine. Right, I think it's a nine by nine. Let's spray it. Okay. Let's see. Mm. It's done. Perfect timing. My hands are clean. So we're going to put about 70%. That's good. Mm, it doesn't look like that much. Did she use two cake cake things? This is a box of cake mix. Hmm. Let's see. We're just gonna press this down. There it is. So you guys can see a little bit better. Oh yeah, I guess once you pat it down, it looks like it is enough. Hopefully these are good. I love like desserts and stuff. So, and I told Landon I was making these when he went to school and he was like, oh, you better save me some. I was like, of course. Like, you think I'm gonna eat all of them by myself? And he was like, maybe. Like, thanks for calling me chunkers. Okay, so now I gotta figure out a kind of candy to put in here. Um, So I kind of want to do like a monster mash. So I'm actually thinking about spreading some eyeball. Ooh. I want to do like a monster mash. I'm actually going to spread some like eyeballs everywhere. I have these like leftovers from actually from last year. Um, let's just put the rest in there. Um, I realized my kids actually ate all of the M&Ms. So I actually have a mixture of Reese's. Twix, Snickers, M&M's, chocolate chips, all that, and we're just going to monster mash. Add the sweet condensed milk. I've always been told to open it upside down. I don't know if anyone else does that, but. I'm just gonna zhuzh it around and then I'm gonna put the rest of this. I definitely feel like if you did the bigger pan, I feel like it would be too thin. Maybe I fucked it up by doing a smaller pan, but. Now we're going to bake it for 25 minutes. Alexa, set the cake timer for 25 minutes. So, as that cooks, I'm going to. I love condensed milk. Um, um, I don't know what should I do. I should clean up my kitchen. Now it's a mess. I'll clean up my kitchen. So as that's cooking, I'm gonna quickly just like 
wipe down my counters and everything. Um, I feel like whenever my kitchen is clean and like my downstairs living area, like this area, because I have like bolted ceilings and like I have an open concept, so obviously you see like my dining room, my living room. Um, I feel like when this area is clean, my house is clean. My house feels clean. My house feels good. Um, and so I think I'm gonna quickly give this a little clean, a little sprucey spruce. Um, I think my mom may come over. Um, she's leaving work right now, so she just called me. I think she wants to come over. Um, so if she does, hang out with her for a little bit. Um, I have to pick up Landon and I have to leave here to pick up in like about just over an hour. So maybe she'll hang out for a little bit or something. I don't know. Um, I bet you any money. My Landon probably wants to go to her house. He's like obsessed with my mom. Um, he was asking, is she working today? I was like, I'm like, oh, he's like, yeah. And he's like, I wish I could see her. I have a random rock right here. Why? Like, why? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna quickly speed clean this. Um, I do want to put my boys' laundry away upstairs. So I'm gonna put on some music. And I'm gonna clean. So watch me. Alexa, play. What are you doing? What is that? What is that? A bag? It's just a bag. <laughs> Out. It cooked for 25 minutes. I don't know. I'm assuming it's gonna be done because it says that it needs to sit where it's gonna be all gooey. It's definitely like bubbling over here. It smells really good. Um, I'm gonna let it sit for like 30 minutes maybe, and then I'm probably gonna pop it into the freezer. Um, but I just want my pan to get a little cool before I put it in the freezer so it doesn't like crack on me or anything. Um, but yeah, I'm going to actually. Come with me. I have to still bring that away, but I forgot that I actually need to, um, I have to wash the, what is this called? Car seats. That Bo and Cameron's car from when we went to our trip. I don't know if I talked about this, but we went to the White Sands um, this past weekend. It was so much fun. Um, I was going to vlog it, but I decided I was going to have actually no phones. I barely took a lot of pictures. Camera, she took most pictures. Um, but we went, but it was just so sandy. So we had to actually um, get that thing. Um, it's like my favorite cleaner from like anything. Um, but yeah, we went and it just, it was just, so, it's sand. It's legit sand. So they got everywhere. Um,
gonna lie to you guys. It's 2.30 right now. Asher just woke up. And this is not cooled yet. Um, let me just say, I can't help myself. And it's definitely like a mess. I just thought so. But it is so good. Oh my god. It tastes like all the candies in there. I can probably eat this just like this. But I won't. Yeah, I'm gonna go put it in my outside fridge. It's bigger. Um, and then hopefully by the time we come back from the gym, it'll be done. My um, mom was gonna come over, but she's like, I kinda need to take a nap. So she was like, after you pick up Lana from school, can you just drop off the boys? So, wow, look at this hair. Um, I'm gonna do that. So I'm not gonna bring the girls any treats. Um, but I'm gonna put this mouse right here. So, since I am gonna go right to my mom's house after picking up Landon and then go to the gym. I'm just gonna actually pack. I'm actually probably just gonna work out in this today. I think today's my shoulders. I think today's like shoulders. And I think I'm probably just gonna focus on like shoulders, probably some core. Um, and I'm gonna do a mix of arms. I didn't do, um, two inch biceps the other day. I did try it, but not two inch biceps. Um, so I think today we're gonna do the shoulders, the core, cardio, all that fun stuff. So I'm actually gonna pack my bag. Um, uh, Asher woke up and he's like cranky. But I did these, so they're all done. Gotta get my gym bag. Um, gym bag, check, I need my, let me tell you. I know a lot of people, like, I, I was one of them. Not a lot of people, but I was one of them too. I hated the bum bag. I think, like, if you wore, like, I think you're, like, a little, uh, I don't know. I don't know what I thought, but I just wasn't behind it, okay? And now, I am, like, a fan. I love wearing my Lululemon. I think it's called a belt bag. I, I call them bum bags. But, um, I'm, like, obsessed. And I love wearing mine. I did have to get mine off of Mercari. Like, like I, it was actually brand new. Oh. Sorry, boys. Dentist is calling me. Got my bag packed. Got him a little snack. You want to say hi? He's a little upset. Um, Mama, can Okay, we'll get you a lot. Um, but we're going to go pick up Landon right now. And then you're going to go to Abel's house while I go to the gym. Okay. We'll say bye. We'll see you later. Hola. We're gonna make some salmon. <clears throat> I ended up getting a new piece at Albertsons because I was afraid of mine. It just had like a brown spot and it looks like funky to me. So I just we're gonna toss it. So I'm just gonna do a little bit of olive oil. I love salmon. Salmon's like our new favorite. Do some onion powder. Some garlic powder. You can't under season it. You gotta give it some things, some paprika. Oh! <gasps> paprika. Oh no. Well, paprika. And then some salt and pepper. Don't open. 
overthink it. Right, Cameron? Then you just air fry it on like 425 for about like 13 minutes. I always overcook mine just because I'm always afraid of it being like raw. But yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a nine in there already. Fuck nine. Alexa, set salmon timer for 13 minutes. going on and that it's crispy top so good and this stuff is so good too the pf chang's uh, sriracha mayo Let's take a little bit of that in you're drinking my pina colada very cool I feel like it's like pineapple-y. No, 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 you're right, you're right, you're right. Coconutty. I like those. That's All right, come eat. Little... I'm gonna hang by the <laughs> coat hanger by, by your pants. Next time I make them, I think I'm gonna put the cookie, the eyeballs on top, cause they didn't really turn out that good. But I promise they still taste really good. Okay. You're supposed to put your peaches on first. You guys think. What do you think? Ghostbusters. Huh? Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters, are they good? Ghostbusters. Do you guys like them? Mm -hmm. Can you tell me what they like? There's, uh, there's, there's candy in here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Say goodnight. Bye. Okay, we'll catch you guys till next time. Next time. All right, we'll catch you guys next time. Bye.